Hey, what's going on guys? This is our whip, come on in. This is kind of a cool sign right here. It's our driver's little man cave. Uh, he's got a really funny headset, but I think he actually took it. He's got this cool little headset that he talks to his other friends. And it's got this big red ball on it. Looks like a clown. It's pretty cool. Um, but he's a great driver. He's drove for Salt and Peppa. He's drove, drove for uh, J. Cole, a bunch of, bunch of cool artists. So I, I enjoy sitting up here during the day, especially on like nice drives like Northern California and stuff like that and just filming and it's just such nice drives up there so it's, it's cool but this is a this is a newer bus um, and we also bring some toys with it too so we obviously got the Wii here a lot of Mario Kart going on and the Xbox as well uh, a lot of Madden lots of Madden between these guys the best at Madden no, our, drop tech, our drop tech Casey and, and Jaime have a, I'm the best. Have a lot of I'm battles. The best. I'm Casey's the best. The best. I'm the best. I'm for it. I'm the best. <laughs> so yeah, this is uh, the front lounge. <clears throat> this is where we do the most chilling. Uh, it's pretty comfy. It's a pop out, obviously, so we get a lot more room. Uh, when we're kind of just getting ready for the show. We can warm up in here, in here if we want, so. Hey! Oh, we got some peanut butter and some Gatorade. Nice weird mix, but what's in here? Oh, chips and Coke. Sorry. Sprite. This is Cam. This is our assistant tour manager, aka our babysitter. Oh, this is actually pretty funny right here. This is a. Uh, if you get third place while racing a four player race, this is a third place hat. You have to wear it for the next match. Uh, that's pretty funny. We always have a different hat too on tour. Uh, let's see here. This is the water drawer. It's not very fun. This is the poker set. We, uh, people want to lose some money. And this is Vic's potion. Vic's been doing some apple cider vinegar. Try and stay healthy. Huh? I don't think it tastes very good though. Oh, this is, oh yeah, we can talk about this. Cody Friday. Every single day we have a day off. The day before is called Roadie Friday. And everyone suits up in Hawaiian shirts. It's pretty awesome. Bunch of smelly socks. This looks like Jaime's workout drawer. Jaime likes to lift the weights and get real buff before the shows. And, uh, <clears throat> yeah, we got a cool little table here. Enjoy uh, your, late, your late night Hot Pockets. I don't know what that is. Some kind of art. <laughs> Tony st starting the day early with a Strongbow. Um, some of our good friends just brought us this. We are in Chicago and this is actually distilled in Chicago. So I believe uh, the company that does our sound sent us that. So thank you for that. Uh, let's see here. This is kind of the kitchen area. Uh, you got your microwave. This is actually the trash chute. Just throw your trash down there. There's a big trash can that uh, fills up like three times a day. Yeah, we do have a lot of coffee drinkers on this tour. Uh, personally, I don't drink it too much because it makes me a little too jittery. But uh, Vic loves his coffee. Uh, all the crew, they drink coffee all day. So that is used at all times of the day. Um, and this is the Nutribullet. This is uh, for your juices and stuff like that. Um, I enjoy doing green green juices as well because it makes me feel strong like both. And uh, let's see what's going on here. Oh, some very old bananas. You don't want to eat those. And here we got our, you know, K-cups and our beef jerky. This is very, very important in our band. If we don't have hot sauce, we will not eat. So that is clutch. We got another bottle there. Popcorn. This looks like some kind of workout powder. Uh, that would probably be Jaime. Uh, just lots of snacks. Probably got to clean that out soon. This is the naughty drawer. You got your Jameson. You got your vodka. Forks, spoons, knives. I think there's some more back there. Oh, this is kind of cool. This was from a, uh, a fan the other day at the meet and greet. She gave us our own personalized Jack Daniels Pierce the Veil bottle. 
got our names on it too. Pretty cool. We have the best fans. They bring us cool bottles. <laughs> yeah, so every morning we wake up and there's a new sheet somewhere on the bus. And that's pretty much our day. So we read the sheet. <clears throat> this is what's happening all day. And uh, there's another one over here. Right here you see all-time lows playing at 7. We are headlining over all-time low. We are playing at 8.30. That's kind of a big deal because uh, all-time low, they always try to think they're the, the hot shots. But uh, it's our turn, baby. And yeah, let's move on to the fridge. This is the biggest fridge I've ever seen in a bus. And it is amazing. So let's see what's in it. Okay, let's see here. You got your Heineken. I don't know who drinks Heineken, but it's there if you want one. And there's more Heineken. And lots of lots of cold brew as well. Cold brew is very, very popular. I believe our friend um, makes some of that in Seattle, and he gave us some of that in Seattle. So, um, Almond milk, this is mine. It says my name on it. If anyone drinks it, I will find out, and I will hunt them down in their sleep. Uh, funny thing about being on tour, whenever you purchase groceries, you have to write your name on every single item, or else it'll just disappear. Sometimes it will disappear anyways if your name's on it, which is completely fucked, but, uh, yeah, it's just one of those things. And, uh, let's see here. We got a lot of cheese. Our tour manager loves to just eat cheese for some reason. Leftover Jimmy John's that says Tony. So no one will eat it. And here's some more salsa. This is the habanero salsa. We're big, big fans of salsa. And lots of Gatorade to stay hydrated. And we got the big ass freezer here. Not much in here. See that? That says Mike. Nobody eat those. This is a... Uh, Mike as well. Nobody eat those. Looks like we gotta get our freezer game going a little more. And this is the Banyo. This is for liquids only. No number twos. And it's actually pretty spacious and clean. We like to keep a clean bus. Uh, if anyone leaves stuff around, it's going in the trash. Yeah, so we have many, many bus parties. Uh, you know, we like to cut loose after the shows and so, you know, there'll be a lot of people in and out of the bathroom, and uh, we've definitely woken up the next morning, and there's been something floating around in there that shouldn't be in there. And that's a big no-no. Moving on. These are our sleeping quarters. Uh, this one looks like the junk bunk. That means that it is an extra bunk, and everyone can just throw their junk in it. Plain and simple. Um, yeah, let's see here. I believe these are the crews. Right now we have uh, <clears throat> two buses. One bus is full with crew, and then this bus is the band, tour manager, photographer, and assistant tour manager. Um, so we kind of get a little more space. Uh, and for this tour, actually, we got uh, the band gets condo bunks, and condo bunks are just a little bit bigger than your normal bunks. And uh, especially for me, since I'm a tall guy, uh, it helps out a lot, so I don't hit my head every every time I'm trying to go to bed. So. Condo bunks are where it's at. This is Jaime. I'm down here. This is Vic. And Tony's up here. <clears throat> and I actually kind of souped my bunk up this tour. Um, I bought some extra padding for a little bit more comfort. And a memory foam pillow, which uh, I can't sleep without. I love the memory foam pillows. And uh, this one's kind of cool too because it's got this extra space down here for shoes. Normally a bus, there's just shoes everywhere in this hallway and everyone wakes up to go to the bathroom and they trip over them and it smells and so this is a little bit better with the shoe cubbies and do you hear that sounds like there's a ghost back there oh that would be my brother warming up <laughs> hey I think this has happened before. <laughs> yeah, so this is the back lounge. This is uh, another chill spot. And it has a closet back here as well. So 
we put all our jackets and uh, suits and leather and sweet, sweet stuff. And it's kind of empty back here most of the time, so it's a nice place to come back and relax if you want to get away from, uh, you know, the party going on up there or whatever. And I think we, you know, when, when they're playing like Madden up there and like we don't want to watch, you know, video games, like we'll come back here. So anyone that really doesn't play video games uh, spends more time back here. And, yeah, mostly like a photographer. I'll chill back here with Vic sometimes, and you know, um, yeah, just hang out. There's a TV back here too. And you got your money counter over there. And yeah, so that's pretty much it for the bus. Um, I gotta kick you out now because uh, we gotta start warming up. Get out! Get out of here! Had it.